Oh, oh, what the f Hey guys, what's up? Anthony from Galactic Force Media. Another video coming at you, and this time it's going to be, once again, the bullet pulling, only a little bit more in depth. Yesterday I put up a video of me pulling some of the bullets and all of the comments were, you gotta weigh the powder, you gotta weigh the powder. So we're gonna actually weigh the powder as well as the round, the casing, everything. Okay, we went to Harbor Freight Tools today and we picked up a electronic scale that weighs grains. It is zeroed or it will be zeroed on film so you can see that it just, it does work. We have our bullet puller from Frankfurt Arsenal and we pulled between 10 and 12 bullets or so, and we will be showing you the weight on everything. Also, it's a long video, guys, so strap on in if you really wanna see the science of all of this, and of course, it is fact-finding. I am not putting blame on anybody still, but I will give you some facts. Through the grapevine, I heard that there are approximately 522,000 rounds that were brought across to the US uh, for this lot. And even though we have definite confirmation of four guns being destroyed while using this ammo, two more, based off of the comments, have reached out and said that their, uh, their rifles were destroyed as well, but I'm still waiting on more info. So it's a confirmed four, possible six, just from this slot. So check it out. We're going to do a little bit of bullet pulling, give you guys some of the facts, and I hope you enjoy. Thanks. Talk to you later. It says ZSR 762 by 51, and then it says 22, okay? So these were all pulled from lot 15 box, okay? So, of course, we're using this scale. It's not a specific to weighing bullets or, or for reloading purposes, but it does do grains. So we're going to make sure that this is zeroed for what it says on that screen. And this is a 200 gram weight. So we're gonna put that on there. It's set up for grams right now. 200.0 on the dot. So yes, the scale is zeroed to, to, to this 200 gram weight. Okay, so we're gonna put this over here. We're gonna take some bullets. And the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna weigh the bullet as it is. So there you go, 23.9 grams, okay? 23.8 grams. 23.8 grams. 23.8 grams. 23.7 grams. 23.8 grams, 23.9 grams, 23.8 grams, 23.8 grams, 23.9 grams, number 11, 23.8 grams. Okay, so they were all plus or minus-ish, a tenth of a gram it seems. So what we're gonna do now, because I am gonna dump the powder in here so it's not all over the place, we're going to zero out this with the bowl and then we're gonna go back in and there it is, 200 grams. So we're then going to take the bullet, we're gonna put it in, we're gonna hand tighten just a little bit. And we're gonna go with a couple of whacks. Now, before I whack the hammer to the wood, I noticed yesterday when I was messing around that these were coming out within two hits. And I was a little concerned about that. So let's do a hit. One, nothing. Two, nothing. Three, nothing. Four. Okay, so there's four wax. Now, I don't know if you're going to be able to see that, but we are going to turn the scale back on. We're going to take, make sure everything is out of there. 
we are gonna dump everything in here. We're gonna go to grain. Currently on grain. We're gonna dump everything, including the round, and I'm gonna pull the round. So we're going to carefully pull the round out, and that is 41 grain for this guy in particular. So that's your first one. 40, 41 grain. Now, what I wanna do is see if I can get a close up of the grains itself uh, using a macro lens. Again, I'm no expert. Maybe you guys can tell me what's up. Okay, let's do the next one, guys. Throw our bullet in there. And tighten down. Let's see how many wax. One, two, three, four. Okay, so we're getting four wax. Yesterday we were getting two. And let's see, there's. All right, again, we're gonna go with the bullet and the grain. I'm gonna take everything out. We're gonna take, I mean, we're gonna take, we're gonna leave the bullet. And that's coming up as 41 grain. So there's your, oh, actually, hold on a second, 43. Forty-one. All right. Okay, hand tighten. One. Two. That came out in two. So that, that, that came out in two. So let's see what we're looking at. There's your brass. Zeroed out. Pull the projectile. 41 grain. Give it a shake, throw it back in there. 40. All right. It's a very close up of the grains. Going in. I said that last one was two wax. One, two. Again, two, two waxing out, guys. Usually it takes three to four from what I've been told. Sometimes five. Again, same thing. We're going to throw the bullet in there. Make sure we get all of it. There's the round. And this one is coming up as, let's give it a, 37. See if I can just get that centered a little bit more on there. 37. So this one compared to the other ones has been underpowered so far. Uh, okay, let's go to the next one, I guess. Again, two wax, guys. Two wax. Brass, all right. Keep going. Pull the bullet through. We're gonna shake that one up and level it better. There's no way that that's gonna have that little 35. Okay, so that's the lowest we've seen so far. Get that round in there. Tighten down. All right, so let's see what, how many wax. I'm not slamming it. I'm hitting it moderately. One, two. Again, two wax, guys. Out and two. Press. Okay. 
Okay, get that guy out of there. Uh, another one at, well, again, we're gonna just Thirty-five. So again, short of what would normally be supposed to be forty, I believe forty-one. I'm not sure. You guys, again, you're the experts. I'm just a shooter. You tell me. All right, here's another one, guys. We got uh, five left. One, two. They're all coming out in two wax now. That seems suspicious to me. Brass. All right. Okay. 43. Okay, so we went from 41 to 43 to 37 to 40. It, it's definitely not consistent. Yeah, tell me in the comments what the acceptable plus or minus rate is for something like this. Are we allowed uh, a difference of five on either side? I, I don't know. You tell me. I, I don't know, guys. Um, grain again, this looks like a bunch of granulars. And then every now and then you'll see a dash. You'll see one of those dashes in. It looks like a, like a, like a rod. There's a big rod in that one. Yeah, 43. There's a nice, I don't know if you guys can see it, but right there, there's a big rod and then there's a bunch of balls and then there's smaller balls. I don't know if this is mixed powder or not. Again, I'm not a professional. You guys are the reloaders. You guys have been telling me what you know. Four bullets left, guys. Another one. This is, we have four left as of this one. Three. One. Two. Getting them in two wax. Brass. Get that bullet out of there. So this one's sitting at 40. All right. One. Two. Still not out. Three. Okay, that was three wax. Thirty-seven, but we are going to give it a quick thirty-seven. Okay, so once again, under. Well, under from what I'm seeing on the other ones, because I, I don't, I don't know obviously what we're supposed to be looking for. Still no word from ZSR or Battlehawk Armory where I purchased it from. It's unfortunate. Okay, here we go. One, two, came out in two. Slow pour. Thirty-five, thirty-three. Let's let's just get it all centered in there. Thirty-two, and I'll even just for there we go. Thirty-two, guys. That's the lowest of the lot so far. One, two, three. I came out in three wax. Slow 
Ohr. Thirty-seven. So again, underpowered. Well, let's give thirty-seven. You know what? I got one more here from a different uh, box. I'm enjoying this too much. This is a neat little tool. Okay. One, two. Again, came out in two wax, and I'm not even hitting that hard. All right. Thirty-seven, thirty-five. Let's settle it again. Thirty, thirty-five. Should I do one more? Want to do lucky? We'll get. You know what? We're gonna do lucky thirteen. Lucky thirteen. This will be the one that blows up the basement. Watch. One, two. That came out in three. Well, that's interesting. I'm gonna put that one aside. That one looks smaller. Number 13, guys. 30 grain. <laughs> okay. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's not enough. Okay, that's interesting, huh? All right. I don't know what any, you guys tell me. You guys are the experts. What's going on here? We're gonna just weigh the bullets. Battlehawk Armory's website said 147 grain, right? So let's just start weighing them. 148. 146. 148. 148. 149, 151, 150, 151, 151, 151, 151, wait, that was, yeah, 151, and then I got to get the one on the floor, 151, 152, so none of the grains match, and you know what, since I got you here, and I know you guys are Oh, here's one more. I guess I pull one more. Whoops. 151. Now, I don't even know if this is going to do anything for you guys, but I got the brass. 180. 178. 182. 180, 
178, 180, 180. One seventy one one eighty one eighty one eighty. Oh, and I got one more here. We're going to call it <laughs> one eighty two. Okay, so definitely inconsistencies. Um, Wow, this is a long video, huh? All right, well, if you guys made it to this point, I want you to put in the comments, uh, let's see. I want you to put in the comments, ZSR needs to put out a statement if you made it this far in the video. That's how I'll know you made it this far, guys. ZSR needs to put out a statement. You know, throw it in your comments somewhere. Thank you so much, guys. Any questions, comments, concerns, Bitches, gripes, complaints, please send them to galacticforcemedia at gmail.com. Like, subscribe, pass the video on. Talk to you guys later. Be ready for that next video, guys. It's the big update. Thanks a lot.